Hi, I'm Alex, and this is Draw MIDI. It's a MIDI controller with different paper keyboards. Today we're going to look at paper circuitry and how you can actually use it to make music. So basically what I've done here is I've made a MIDI controller built around the Arduino Uno microcontroller. Microcontrollers can read analog voltage signals and can be programmed to use that information to interact with your computer or other objects in many different ways, making them a very powerful creative tool. An Arduino has pins just like a breadboard, and wires from these pins are connected to the magnetic copper tape on the bottom of the box. Now, Arduino has its own coding language that lets you tell it what to do with the information from these pins, and I've told it to send MIDI messages every time it sees a signal. This is basically the same thing that's happening inside your MIDI keyboard, except the notes are triggered by keys being pressed. The cool thing about this controller is that the notes are triggered by you pressing down on the paper circuit. The paper circuit takes advantage of the conductivity of pencil graphite. Every time the circuit is touched, the signal travels up through the graphite wire, into the copper strip, through some more wire, and then into the Arduino, where it triggers the MIDI note. And because the sensors are all graphite, I can draw whatever shapes I want to trigger the notes. As microcontrollers and controllerism grow in popularity, paper circuitry is being implemented in more and more places. Experiment with it yourself. We have Alex's code and some links to some Arduino basics in the description. So, uh, you, you take lessons? How long have you been playing the paper? Yeah, I've been taking private P <laughs> Done. Great. Great. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs>